Hello guys and welcome Mills to 2000 here, just bringing you another episode of the Race 2 Division 1. Um, in my last episode I managed to get a win and a draw, however for some reason it seemed to mess up and give me a loss when I didn't even go into the game which is pretty annoying so hopefully in this episode I will be able to get two wins. Um, but yeah, so this is my team if you haven't already seen it once. Um, I added Baines, Team of the Week Baines to it because I wanted to try him out and I've just switched it over with a few of the players. Um, yeah, pretty decent squad, I've enjoyed it, it's got me through quite a lot. As people have started um, playing FIFA 14 a lot more and you can use uh, you can use points and stuff to buy players, the teams that you come up against are a lot better, so uh, it's a proper test now. And then we finally get into a game here with What's his team? He's got a pretty average team, but some fairly few decent players in there, so it should be a decent game. And we're just about to get into it, and this is gonna be the kickoff. Yeah. In here, he um, manages to break through the defense and score a cheap little goal with Huntelo. My play, my defender just ran away from the header for some reason. It was an OP header and he ran away from it. So that put him 1-0 up in the 14th minute. But then I go and come back with Delafu. Spanks it into the corner. Absolute great goal. He's a sick player. Definitely recommend him. Pacey right winger for Everton. Definitely go and get him. He should be fairly cheap. That was in the 19th minute. I leveled it. And then in the 26th minute, De Bruyne just manages to use some cheeky footwork around all of his players. Oh. A few of his defenders, and he scored an absolutely sick goal in the 27th minute, which is beautiful. It was, it was insane. Look at it, he manages to get past three defenders there. So, yeah, 2 1. And in the 35th minute, I've put a corner in, OP corner in, OP Louise manages to OP head it into the back of the net, which was a pretty decent goal for me. I'm now 3 1 up. Um, which is pretty nice, obviously his team's not that great, but yeah, not bad. And then that's the half-time whistle gone, just then 45 minutes and done. Um, I'm winning 3-1, got 52% possession, had 6 shots, 5 on target, so I'm doing pretty well. Not too bad if I, don't, if I say so for myself, but this is the second half. And in the 49th minute, he manages to get a, get a goal back um, with... Muller and it just seemed to go through all the players so that's how he got the goal but it's 3-2 and then Delafar runs down the wing and Ben Teke manages to make a bit of space for himself and score an OP header which makes it 4-2 now I'm extending the gap a bit which is decent because uh, he managed to close it a little bit with that goal that he scored in the 50th minute so yeah and then in the 61st minute, I get another corner and Ben Teke again rises above everyone in the box and manages to head it in, which makes this game 5-2, which is looking like a great win for me. Um, great win for my division race. And then Ben Teke cheekily puts the ball into Wilshire and Wilshire absolutely places it in a sick place, to be honest, in the 74th minute. Beautiful finish just there, and let's go and watch the replay now. Absolutely sweet run by him, and look at that left footed volley into the post. No way the keeper was saving that bad boy, and this is now the end of the game. That was a 6 2 win for me. That means I've got two wins, one loss for some reason, and one draw, which is pretty decent. That's put me on seven points now. Um, and I'm projected to go and win this. I've got six games remaining. Yeah, so let's go and get into the next game. This is another game. I'm just searching for an opponent now using the same team I was in that one because it worked really well. So hopefully I'll go be able to go and get another win. So let's see who we come up against in a few minutes. And we come up against Manchester FC, Sergeant Pepper 32 with a Man Manchester United kit. So let's see who we come up against. He's got pretty decent team overall, pacey and strong, so this should be a difficult game. But then we come into the first half now, kick off. 
in the seventh minute, he manages to use a little bit of footwork, and Kagawa just manages to literally roll it into the bottom corner, which is a bit of a pain, just because that finish wasn't actually, it was good, but it wasn't, it, it didn't deserve a goal, I'd say. But he just makes manages to make a bit of space because my defender's just opened up and he placed it in the corner. And then the 32nd minute he manages to break free just then and almost go and score. But then in the 41st minute he chips the ball over to Oliver Giroud and he placed it in the back of the net which is pretty, pretty appalling to me. It's another OP finish there. The OP through ball went up for OP Louise out of his position. Which is a right ball here, because that leaves it 2 0 just before the halfway half time. And yeah, this is the half time. He took ages to get on to it. He didn't skip it, so I just skipped it into the half time. And then hopefully we'll have a decent second half. Hopefully we'll have to get some goals back. Because yeah, that first half was pretty poor. He has a pretty strong and decent team. I haven't even had any shots at anything. <laughs> um, but yeah, this is the second half. In the 62nd minute, he manages to break through with De Bruyne, unfortunately, and go and peel into the back of the back of the net, which is an absolute pain in the arse for me, as I was wanting to try and come back in this game. However, it seems very unlikely now, because that's 3-0 up to him, and only a little bit of time left to go. Yeah, but then, guess what happened? In the 76th minute, an absolute peach of a fruit ball there into Sterling he fights one off, fights two off and plays it in the back of the net who would have thought Raheem Sterling would have been able to do that, what an absolute beaut of a goal just then and now it's 3-1 so yeah, it's getting a bit better now for us and in the uh, 86th minute Delafu managed to play, sprint past that play and score an absolute beaut of a goal just then and that was an absolutely insane finish from him then as he managed to chip it beautifully into the bottom corner so now it is 90th minute and guess what he goes and does he goes and be a dick he passed it around the back for the last remaining few minutes and then yeah he goes and unfortunately wins that game I'm going to bring it back hopefully and I was starting to bring it back but then he went <laughs> started being a prick which uh, shows how much of a good player he is but then this is coming to the end of the episode and I managed to win one game and lose one game unfortunately so that leaves us with seven points with five games remaining hopefully in the next episode I should be able to get a promotion so yeah if you enjoyed this video make sure to leave a like and if you're new here don't forget to subscribe and I'd appreciate it a lot peace